I'm here after a 16 to 15 win for the Nichols women's lacrosse team with Nichols women's lacrosse head coach Will Mraz and from left to right student athletes Mackenzie Muir and Mackenzie Duran. Uh, first coach with you, you're two and zero to start the year. Um, start off the year yesterday with a 22 goal victory tonight just by one, so it's kind of been a tale of two games so far, but. Uh, Nonetheless, tonight you prevailed over Emerson in a hard-fought battle. What can you say first about the game tonight and about your lacrosse team, what you're learning about them so far? Yeah, I mean, I think we're, we're still kind of a mix of returning players and the new younger players and still trying to figure out how everybody fits into the mix. But today was just, uh, you know, just a tough game where we just we kept plugging and got ahead, and when they caught up, we just kept doing what we needed to do. I'm going to start to your right uh, with <laughs> Mackenzie Muir. We got two Mackenzies here tonight, so uh, great to have both of you with us. But Mackenzie, uh, tonight with for you, um, what was working for you guys trying to keep the ball out of the net? Um, I think a lot of it was on the draw. I've got to give a lot of credit to Liz Lester and Emma Patton. They knew exactly where to direct it, and I was just there to pick it up when they did all the hard pushing. Mackenzie, on the other side tonight for you, you led the team with six points, uh, at least five goals uh, on, on the evening. Uh, what was working for you offensively and what's been working for your team the last two games, scoring 38 goals in two games? Yeah, definitely the quick passes helped when we can get the other team on their toes. Uh, those quick passes really, when we get past them, they make all the difference. Coach, Monday you take on SUNY Purchase at home. That'll be three straight home matches in a row for the team. And then you go to Florida. Um, what are you looking forward to in first the home game to uh, wrap up the home stand and then the trip to the Sunshine State? Yeah, I think that uh, I'm looking for us to use these two games now to just kind of sort ourselves out and start to get our lacrosse IQ going and get everybody to start playing as a team. I think we, we did that better in the second half today. And um, we're going to take that down there and then, you know, we'll kind of be who we are, I hope, when we play Warner on Friday. Great. Thank you, all three of you. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs>